Hello friends, uh, welcome again and this is my new project online art gallery and this project I have developed in Java, JSP and MySQL and uh, for front end I am using the HTML, CSS, JavaScript and some of the jQuery library for doing some good effects like calendar integration and the form validations I am using the jQuery for versions I am using the JDK version 1.8 uh, Tomcat version 7 also uh, this project can be configured easily on the Tomcat version 8 also so uh, these are the versions and and if you have if you have netbeans or the eclipse then you can configure this project on the netbeans as well as eclipse but on both of the id you must have the Tomcat server for running this project i didn't test this project in uh, glassfish environment right so this is all about the technology so let's start with the functionality so this is the uh, project title online art gallery and this is a mini project and uh, there is only an only single user role login based system that is a customer there is no admin available in this project means customer will be able to perform all the operations right and there is no login for the admin so let's start with the functionality so this is the home page of the project as you are seeing some products are coming on the home page and it's coming from the database right so currently that we have added 12 products in the database that's why it's coming 12, 12 products but if you need want to add more then you can add more products on the database so this is the product details so if you click on any of the product then you will be able to see the details of the product and you will be able to add the cart item right so this is the add to cart okay now currently we have two products available right so this is all about suppose if i want to add this one then i can add also this in the database so this is the about the session this is the static page and i am not saving the data sorry and uh, this is not running from anywhere from the database so if you want to update this content then you can update it directly into the html pages this is the all arts gallery so this is all at gallery and if you want to filter out the things then you can filter it from here right so this is all items and spread traditional questions print and this same details are filtering here right so this is the shop by category the same thing is available here also right so the same so you can add more category from the database right this one this is the registration so if you the, you don't have the user id and password then you will be able to register from here and after it you will be able to register from those details right this is the login page from where customer will be able to log in and this is a contact us page so this is the static contact us page and i am not saving the data of this contact us page anywhere in the database okay so that's why it's a static contact us page so let's start and i'm going to buy some of the items so this I want to add this one more item so add to cart so currently i have four items in the cart so the total cost is seventy three thousand and eight hundred rupees so if you want to remove this one then cart cost will be automatically updated right so if you want to click on the continue shopping or proceed to checkout so if i don't want to add more things into the cart just click on the proceed to checkout and here you need to enter the user id and password if you click on the login then it will be redacted to the shipping address and you will add shipping address here right so you can add anything once you click on the proceed to payment this is a sample payment gateway means it's not a real payment gateway this is a dummy payment gateway and i am not uh, saving anything in, uh, anywhere in the database so you don't need to put any valid card detail just enter the dummy details anything which you have right and the expiry month and it and the total amount which you want to pay right so you can't edit it because it's calculating from the backend once you click on the make the payment then you will be able to see the order details so your order item is 18 and the total amount you have paid is 2008 sorry 23,080 rupees 800 rupees right so this is the full flow so this is the dashboard of the customer means what the customer can do customer can say the home page shopping more my orders my orders means customer will be able to see all of his order history right so there are three orders which has been placed by customer and customer will be able to see uh, all of this this is the my account section from where customer will be able to update and see his account details the 
and if customer want to uh, uh, shop more then a customer can shop more from here also okay so one more thing i want to show you so the above menu is totally session driven right so you can see the above menu and if you click on the lower the above menu has been gone and if you click on the login again the above menu is coming so this is totally session driven the system is get is checking that uh, uh, system uh, user is login or not if user is login then the above menu will be displayed according to the user authentication and if user is not login then uh, above menu will not be displayed according to the uh, means uh, the logout and the my order and the check, uh, my account section will not be displayed okay so this is all about the project online ad gallery so if you need more functionality in this project just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes and i will make this project more better and better according to requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest video updates on the latest analysis thanks for watching the video thank you very much